Um, that isn't exactly the case here. Transformers Animated has a lot of details, but mostly it's important details rather than the quantity of them. Because you have so many cha characters and they are so easy to move and to stretch and to squash and whatever. So they, I think they chose not to put too much detail because of that. Um, there we go. They also usually have slim necks. It's not always a rule. You have Striker who is consciously <laughs> every rule against a female like feature and yet she manages to be a female. Though that's mostly because of her voice. The shoulders are usually roundish. Um, but again that's really that really all depends on you. Um, a feature I really like to do in characters are the boosters. Mostly back boosters. You can easily create them like so. They usually have a larger part in the up area and it slims down to the lower area and you have a small little connection to the back. What you do with this later on it's all up to you again. You can add stripes, you can whatever. Um, it isn't a necessity but it helps a lot to balance the femme look because since they're fem female they usually look very light um, which make the, makes them easily looking unbalanced so it can help you a lot if you put on boosters now um, for the arms um, this is this in case you're doing the alt form first or later whatever if you want to think about it the arms are usually usually the um, car doors so they don't normally look exactly like the car doors you have the regular car right and what happens is the arms go here because they have a connection with the elbow that comes to the front of the car and here you have shoulders usually um, so the arm, the elbow and the shoulder and of course the chassis is in the middle of the car hidden by the shoulder back goes normally here and the back of the car is usually the legs having the ties over here near the arms um, now for because of that most of the time they have slim arms Right? Though I've done a case in which a femme has a very roundish arm, which can work pretty, pretty well because if you look at Bumblebee's design, he has a very bulky arm, right? This part of the arm is very bulky, yet it's the car door like I just showed you anyway 
For this particular case I'm going to make it simple and I'm going to keep it slim as well because most of this form looks slim anyway. So we have a character with slimy arms and I'm going to give her long tender fingers to help enhance this look. Um, if something isn't working, which is usually the case when I get to arms, you have many things you can add, like weapons or some sort of scanner, gloves, um, subspaces, whatever. If not, make it anyway, just so it looks good. It'll probably come to you later and you'll figure out what it is. Um, alright. One of the most common details you can find in TFA is the limb division. These parts right here. Um, they help a lot to make the character look more interesting and it's not a very important detail but in quantity and well placed it can really look awesome. Alright, um, now for the chassis. It's usual that the females have smaller chassis than the max so keep it small in place unless you have a really specific alt form that really depends on the alt form sometimes. Um, my first warning about these is don't try to give them breasts. Seriously, don't try to give them breasts. It looks horrible, it's unlogical and it looks pretty bad. <laughs> Quite honestly, I think it looks very very bad. You can, however, make details that look somewhat similar to breasts, such as the visions, headlights, glass, whatever. It's not really that hard to figure out. Um, Sure, so, um, what am I going to say about sure, so, um, there is a lot you can do in this area, in particular. Usually there's patterns, like so. Usually you do something like this, a pattern, and then the hips, right? Um, there's a lot you can add in this part because there's so many patterns, there's so many details, pockets, whatever. You can add hip adjusters, which I don't see many people using, but I think they look, re look really cool. Um, I'm just going to give her a simple pocket a smaller one right behind it. There we go. <sighs> um um however you can skip this whole part and make a torso with the hips, right? 
um, in letters 